I bought this sign in 2011, the day that I opened. And that was the car that was on it. That looks very familiar. And then I bought that car, and I didn't know that that was on my sign. And I had my car parked under the sign one day, and a customer was like, hey, same car that's on the sign. And I looked up at the sign, and it was sitting in that, and was like, holy crap. No problem, Mark. This is Dean from Blackout. I was just calling to let you know that your remote start's all done and your key is done. Okay, sounds good. We'll see you soon. The only thing I have left is the rocker panel, the vent inside of it, which is like 20 minutes, and then the inside of this door, which is the hardest piece I've ever wrapped in my life. Shock covers. I mm -hmm. polish these bars, and you can still see on the engine covers. I still have to do those. I tried doing it with the three inch, but there's like some staining on them. But it, I mean, it, it works some of it. Yeah. So I got to do that by hand a little bit. But other than that, it came out really good. This was torn up, and that came out like it was hammered. So it's cracked and really easy. Alex's truck. Do you, you have any time to put a seat in front? Goalie? The uh, Yeah. Is there any way? Can we pull it in the front? Can we pull it in the front? Or is it, is he working on electronics or anything? Hey, wait till you hear these gems. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. It's from, it's from your prime, John. Um, Were you in your prime in the 2000s? You guys just want to do a lap around the building? No, dude, this would, this would be torture. You make somebody push this around the building five times. No, I'm good. You got another three feet before I'll get to your table. For a detail and one's coming for a wrap. Do you have any idea which one that might be? Was it a Model S or a Model 3? I don't know. It's blue. I don't know. I'm going to go over and get it and bring it over. Okay. 
put our sides back up and have him not take them down? Like, or just do we need to have Luke and myself telling everybody, hey, next yeah. year come to the new building? Yeah. Hey, but, but figure out, figure out what that Tesla is. Call Luke and see what the conversation was with the Tesla guy. Because he just talked to somebody. I think it was the guy that was calling asking if we could squeeze him in for a detail. I think you're right. Did we tell him yes? I believe so. When does he need squeeze back? Like, is it need done today? I, I don't remember. I remember us talking about it today. That was, I think, earlier this week. We need to figure that out. I got these little spaghetti strip pieces of film. And what's the best phone number for you? So he has this Ford that is his daily driver, and then he has 16 other cars, classic muscle cars, and a couple motorcycles that he wants to get coated as well. So that could be a massive, like $50,000 project by the time we're done. So it could be interesting. No, but go ahead. All right. So, so my mother uh, clogged the sink at apparently one of the holiday dinners. I think it was Thanksgiving or Christmas. And she was busy running around like a nut. And it, for like a day, the sink sat and clogged. So I thought I'd be nice because she wasn't at home. I was probably 18. And I was going to unclog the sink. So I reached out into the sink and I'm digging around in the drain. And I like could not figure out what was going on. And then my arm started to hurt. Really weird. Everywhere, like where metal was touching my hand, it hurt really bad. So I pulled my hand out and eating, literally eating the skin. I watched it just start to eat the skin off of my hand, and I freaked out. And I turned water on, and I started rinsing it. It was getting worse. It was like it created a huge scab on the whole top of my hand. So I'm like, what the heck? So I called my mother, thinking she must have put Drano or something in it. And she's like, no, it wasn't Drano. I used some kind of chemical, but it didn't work. And I said, where's it at? She said it's in the garbage. So I started digging through the garbage, and my hand is like, it has like this slimy film on it, and it's burning. I dig through the garbage, it's potassium hydroxide, which I didn't know anything about until I researched it. Apparently, it is really brutal. If you get it in your eye, you go blind, all kinds of craziness, and uh, it was all over my hand. <laughs> so, fun fact, I had to use a brush on my whole arm to get it off, and it was ripping skin off with the brush. <laughs> off the inside. I think you're good right there. Oh, there it is. 